All right, we are back. And just did a 105, but I only just barely did it. There's only two pylons, and the first couple of maps were really horrible, but, I mean, it was only a 105. You know, my other build, Energy Twister, did 112. Critical hit. So this has got kind of a wasted ability. That's got kind of a wasted ability. I could try a 110, but man, 110, I would have to... Now, the thing is, when I did that 105, I was not playing as well as I probably could have been. Pretty sure I was forgetting to cast Blizzard. One thing I was thinking of trying, things didn't work out, although I can't see how this is going to help, but I could get rid of Explosive Blast, the Orb of Infinite Depth, instead go in with Unity and Teleport. I mean, this is great when I've got the stacks. But if I forget to cast it or don't quite have all the stacks, then... Not so sure exactly how well it's working at that point. And then there are times when it seems like I just can't hit the enemies. I should I should at least try it once. The only other problem I think is that I don't know how good this winter flurry is gonna be. No, I'm not using cold skills. I don't need the arcane power. I don't even know if I can switch out that cold skill. Not that I couldn't use cold skill. I might might even want to try cold. Okay, I can. I can switch that out.
I mean, I could try it. At least then that way, you know, this wouldn't be going completely to waste. If I were going to switch over to cold, I'd probably want to do this one. Switch out that critical hit. So let me try that. And then if the cold doesn't work out, I can do this one and switch out that cold skills deals. And it's ancient legendary. Switch out, let's switch out that critical hit skin for our king power. Probably for vitality. So, so this is gonna do because I'm gonna be going with cold it's gonna deal an extra 17 it's gonna be an extra 11% damage and of course the hydra damage an extra 3% there Be losing out on the critical hit chance, but All right. so we're gonna put that there. Cube here, we're gonna put Serpent Sparker. And here we're going to put probably unity, right? Because that might be better than unity. 100%. Let's try this. It's going to take for that to kick in. Kick in right away, shouldn't it? I've dug up some new things for you to take a look at.
60% of my life, so that should be 120% of my life. There we go. And then this is going to be 200% of my life per second. So it should be another 300. There we go. Okay. your deepest wish to serve my order valorously well you sound disappointed and that's not even including wealthy and surrounded by beautiful women these two is simply lacking by That might might be even be even better defense, but the main reason for this whole thing teleport. To be able to get to the next rift faster. But what I'm losing is the potential damage increase from The Ord of Infinite Death, which is... Uh, 40%, is that 40%? If I've got all four stacks. I don't always have all four stacks. And I'm hoping that that teleport will allow me to get to the next rift faster. I don't know. I got more of a hit point shield. So maybe that will help me keep Squirt's necklace active longer. I've got one less thing to cast in battle. I don't have to worry about explosive blasts so I can just focus on other things. I can focus on the spectral blade. That might work. Let's just try the 105 again. See if I do it any faster. All right. Uh, did I get everything. <coughs> Here we go. Done. Prove yourself worthy.
Why didn't I attack him? It just, I lost too much. I just lost too much uh, defense. I mean, I'm only on a 105, so. Okay, well, I didn't recast my storm armor there, but still. Is once I lose my hit point shield, boom, this kicks in. And I lose, first of all, I take an extra 50% damage, and I lose this 100% damage dealt. This, I mean, with great danger comes great profit. This is seventy seven. Better off putting Halo of Karini here and wearing Unity. Uh, 
or just putting unity in the cube I guess Unity. Should I find some more tire? These old things are becoming so small. You are too kind. Because I could go back to all that other stuff, but then get rid of this. Get rid of magic weapon, and that's kind of what I had here. This was my Hydra Speed Rift. <coughs> I'd gotten rid of this. <coughs> and I had extra damage boost. You know, if you think about it, this is defense and offense. A lot of defense and a lot of offense. This is mainly, it's not even that much. It's 10% offense and that 4% of my life in damage for 3 seconds. Probably, probably that's what I'm going to try next. I don't think I'm just going to, I just don't think I'm going to go with Unity. That, that Orb of Infinite Death, along with Explosive Blast. As long as I can get the stacks, it's, it's just, it's just really powerful. Really powerful defensively. You know, with practice. After doing a few rifts, I'm sure I could get it down to where I've got the four stacks almost all the time. Alright, but I'm not going to do that tonight. Let's, let's just equip it back. Tomorrow when I test it out again, I'll try that. Although, I just don't think the extra teleport, the teleport is going to help that much. Talking you know, a pretty far cry from 112. All right, all right. Let me sign off here, and I'm gonna try it again in the moment. All right, I'll see you all next time. Bye, everyone.